Hi, and welcome to today's devotion. My name is Abimbola, and I, along with my husband Toba, are the African Connect Pastors. We are continuing with our series thought of Therefore Go. In Matthew 28, we read about the Great Commission, where Jesus tells us his followers to go into all the world and make disciples. This week in our devotions, we are on a journey through 2 Corinthians 5.17 that says, Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has gone and the new is here. We've looked at what it is to be a new creation in Christ. Letting go of the old, today we are pursuing the love of Jesus. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, is a new creation. The old has gone, the new is here, according to 2 Corinthians 5.17. It's a humbling thought, actually. Jesus actively seeks out to those um, who feel lost, misunderstood, or unworthy. His love pursues us, not because of anything um, we've done, uh, but because of who he is. Even when we are distant from him, he is close. Ready to extend his hand and lift us from our place of struggle. When we accept Jesus, we step into a relationship that makes us a new creation where the past no longer binds us. In moments of doubt, remember Jesus' unchanging love. It restores and renews even the most broken places of our heart. Today, let's open ourselves to his pursuit and let go of the things that keeps us from fully embracing the life he offers. Let the reality of being a new creation become the source of our confidence and hope, remembering that he restores us daily. Shall we pray? Jesus, thank you for pursuing me and making me a new creation. Help me accept your love and allow it to transform every, every part of my life. May I live each day in the fullness of your grace. Amen.